loser. I'm an actual loser. Um, let's start again, shall we? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're going to be talking about luxury items. Yeah, so I'm just doing a video haul of all the things that I bought at the end of July. So I had a major shop at the end of July and um, these are the things I bought. My hair is just a mess. I've actually just washed it and treated it with coconut oil and I'm going for the natural, the natural look today. Um, so everything I bought, I bought from Selfridges. <coughs> so these were my first purchase. These are from Free People. Look at the bottom. I just love this frayed detailing. Um, there's a lot of celebrities wearing this kind of cropped style with them um, <laughs> getting real popular up in here. The only thing I don't like is these button fastens. I don't know if you can see. I just really hate jeans that have button fastenings. It's just like, why can't you have a zip? I just don't, I just don't understand. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you how I styled them. With my new gorgeous free people jeans, I styled it with a grey cotton t-shirt from James Pierce. I also styled this outfit with a pink top drop choker which I'm going to show next that I also bought. The shoes on my feet are also from Topshop and I got them in this pink colour. The furry detail is so bougie. So the next thing I bought was this amazing Topshop choker. Chokers are in at the moment but I want to do like a nude ensemble. So I bought this and I'll probably wear it tomorrow or later because I've got an event to go to. It's really cool. And I hate to say it because I really hate when people say it but um, it's kind of that Kylie Jenner, Kim Kardashian style. I will be wearing this bad boy tomorrow. Not suitable for children under 14. So for y'all 14 year olds that want to look hip, you can't. You can't do it. So I'm just walking towards the camera so you can see the joker up close. I got it from Topshop, like I said, it was eight pounds. I don't know why it always looks so moody, but I really love this choker. But I think it's super cute and super cheap. And next I got this Raquel Allegra 100% silk shirt, which is very low for those risque nights. So I really like Raquel Allegra's style. Her ethos is that you should encourage, experiment and play, which is what I love to do. I styled it with these All Saints leather pants, which I've had for ages and worn to the death of me. Underneath this shirt, I'm wearing a lacy bra that I also purchased from Selfridges. And on my feet are Margiela heels with a Perspec wedge. This plunge v-neck is literally to die for. Um, I just think it's so sensual. And then I got these framed jeans with a little bit of rips. It's just ripped on one knee and they're just like plain skinny jeans. Frame. I don't really like, I don't even know why I got these because I don't really like frame. Like I've got one pair of, no offence to frame, but I've got one pair of frame jeans and they literally just fell apart and I'm just like, what is the point of that? Like, I, they were skinny jeans, they've now become cigarette jeans because they're just so stretchy. But I thought, I really like these. So I thought I'd just um, see how I got on with these. And they're really cool. So I styled these frame jeans with this checked shirt from Ralph Lauren with velvet collar trimming. On my feet are Zara black heels and these are like one of my most comfortable heels. I've worn these heels to work, I've worn these heels on a night out. I just love these heels. By the way, these jeans are so skin tight, it is a joke. So the next piece that I got was this um, Raquel, another Raquel Allegra piece. I feel like it's never ending. 
I absolutely adore this piece. And the back is like that. And I'm probably gonna wear this top with leather pants, but I'll show you how I style this anyway. But it's just, just effortlessly sexy. Just effortlessly. And I like stuff like that. Like I don't, I don't really like to show too much skin, but I like it to be like kind of mystical. I'm such a fan of Raquel Allegra. I want to know what she's got for her autumn winter collection because I will be purchasing that. Um, but yeah, I love the back detail on this top. I think it's so sexy. It's like effortlessly sexy. So once again, I paired this Raquel Allegra top with All Saints leather jeans. On my waist is a plain black Zara belt and on my feet are my Margiela heels with a Perspex wedge. And then I got these J brand kind of like utility pants in a khaki color. Genesis J brand mid-rise utility zip skinny. I love the zip detail, you know, just in case you wanna be militant one day. I love a lot of khaki, I'm wearing khaki today. But um, yeah, these are pretty cool. I don't even know why I got these because to be honest, I do have like about three or four green pants. Like I've got some other Ralph Lauren ones which are very similar. So it's kind of like, did you really need to purchase this? Not really, but we got them anyway. Oh my God, so I nearly got attacked by a spider. Anyways. Um, I paired these J-Brand pants with a grey and black Alexander Wang jumper. This jumper doesn't actually keep you warm, but at least I look good. How cute are these mules that I got from Gucci? They are so comfortable to walk in, and I bought them in this nude colour, which is great for summer. I don't know what I'm going to do in winter. And then I completely conjectured contradicted myself oh my gosh I can't talk because I got another frame um, pair of jeans but these are culottes so these are like cropped and then they flare at the bottom and they're pretty cool I love frame actually no I don't really like frame but I love their detailing like the little You cannot say or do in summer fashion without a pair of culottes. So I got these culottes from Frame, as I said, and I paired them with this white Zara shirt. And I really like this look. I think I look very smart, very sophisticated. On my feet, I'm wearing Charlotte Olympia Poodle heels. I love Frame detailing. That's the only thing I like about them, to be honest. And now for some Page. It's actually, the brand is not called Page, Page, but it's called Page. But um, whenever I see the retail coordinator, we always make the joke that it's a very, oh. <laughs> I got a text, somebody loves me. Um, but um, yeah, the this is a leather jacket from Page that I got. Um, I got it in the cell for a very good price. Um, and it's like mixed, so it's suede and it's leather, and it's just one of those easy breezy, mm, fierce jackets. We love a bit of page. So I styled this page leather jacket with AG blue jeans, which are ripped at the knees and also have paint splatters on them, which is super cool. The T-shirt I'm wearing is by Wild Fox. It says. I need a ride and on my feet are my Isabel Morant sneakers and I think that they go perfectly with this casual look. This was my absolute favourite buy. I've been wanting this jumper for ages and I finally got it. I don't know what that noise is. I just love this jumper so much. A lot when I Bought, bought this jumper a lot of people were like you're obviously just a crazy person but I saw it on um, 
this what's her name the um made in chelsea star rosie i saw it um on her on her blog was it on her blog or her instagram and i was just like oh my god this thing is a this jumper is amazing and i have to get it i just Anyone that knows me knows I love tassels and I love pom poms and I love anything that just moves. I, oh my god, I love fringe as well. Like I just, I love textures. Um, and this Chinti and Parker, I just, oh, I mean, I just love it. It doesn't really go with my hairstyle. It's a bit too wild at the moment. But um, yeah, and the label is quite cute. It says we strive to create quality clothing with care and consideration. You go, Chinti and Parker, you go. And this one is, what is it? It's 100% cashmere. I can't wait till I get older because all I'm going to be doing is wearing cashmere and tods. I just love cashmere. I can't really go wrong. So this man just appeared from nowhere and I had to start filming again. Like, what the hell? I'm wearing a grey H&M faux leather skirt and on my feet are these purple heels from Office which I think are super cool. These heels are super comfortable and I think I've had them since I was in uni and I don't actually remember purchasing them. And my last piece was this Proenza. It's very basic for the price that it, it was like, it's just, it's it's very basic, but um, it's just a nice classic red and black uh, print tee. So, um, yeah. So because I thought the Proenza tee was very basic, I decided to match it with a different texture. So I matched it with this All Saints leather dress. And the look I was going for was sophisticated rocker chic. On my feet are my Cross Me platform sandals by Kristen Louboutin in kid leather. And um, <laughs> that was it! <laughs> Sorry, I get really excited. Things I get excited about is food, shopping. I shouldn't really say this for drinking. Oh, actually, no, that wasn't my last purchase because I actually bought this. This lovely cleavage. <laughs> Well, it's just a basic grey t. It's just basically a grey t-shirt. There's nothing that you can really say about it. Um, but I bought it from James Pierce. Um, or James Pierce. I don't know how to say it. James. Someone tell me. Is it James Pierce, or is it James Pierce? I don't know. Because someone corrected me once, but I always thought it was James Pierce. It doesn't really matter anyway. I bought this t-shirt from JP, and um, it's so soft. It's like this. What is it? It's 100% cotton, I just checked. Um, it's just really soft and really comfortable. Um, and I'm, and yeah, like there's nothing more to say, but I'm just wearing it casually today. And um, what else am I wearing? I'm wearing this Zara bomber, which I stole from my cousin. Thanks, Tremaine. Found it in my house. Love you, babes. <laughs> um, and I don't know if you can see. Let's zoom in. I'm wearing J Brand Maria high rise skinny jeans with these ripped details. I've got to say, J Brand are the best for high rise jeans. They're just amazing. They suck everything in. They give me a bit of a better bum, to be honest. Um, I'm not going to show my bum. But um, yeah, like, so that's what I'm wearing today. So, guys, I just wanted to say thank you for watching my video on um, my end of July luxury shopping haul as, as you want to say it um and yeah like that's just how i styled my items that's what i bought um and i will be uploading another video very very soon as you guys know i have a blog on going out in london and where to go um and i also get sent things to review i think next time i'm just gonna put my phone on silent because it has been popping out and it's just gonna be nonsense to be honest because no one ever messages me no one ever that I like messages me, should I say? But um, yeah, like um, stay tuned, stay tuned for more. <laughs> so thanks again for watching, guys, and remember to follow me on my other social media platforms. And remember, stay bougie.